Hi everyone, Budget Stark here, and this is probably one of the most anticipated figure pickups of the year. I'm here to pick up the diecast Robocop 1-6 scale with mechanical chair. Now, many guys have been really anticipating this figure. It, if so, if not more than the Mark 42, so I think this will be a, a grail figure for many people that have um, ordered this. So the point is, I'm here to talk about a couple of collectors who have ordered this and I'll be picking up for. So a big shout out goes to Aaron and Shell Collectibles who have ordered this right at the beginning. On top of that we had um, Reveal King that wanted to get a first look at this. A couple of other collectors in the UK, Tom and Andrew, who've requested this as well. But the biggest shout out I think has to go out to Chris, who's also a UK collector. But the point is that every week for the last three months, he's been messaging me saying, is Robocop out yet? Is Robocop out yet? And my response every single time is soon, it'll be out soon. And then eventually when it did came out, I messaged him, said to him, Chris, Robocop's out. No, I don't believe you. I think you're lying. I don't believe you. And I felt a tear fall landed on his phone because there's a typo on his message. I know, Chris, you're super stoked for this figure. And um, I hope you really enjoy it when you finally get it. So let's go inside and have a look. By the way, the doors have just opened and there's a queue already here. So just so to confirm, what we'll be picking up is this figure here, the Robocop with the mechanical chair. So I think you guys may have seen the first look video, which I did uh, a couple of days ago. So this is the full figure with all the accessories that you're getting. Two points um, that I think you should, guys should be aware of. Number one, you need a certain battery that is not included in the pack. I think it's an N type battery, which is an old style uh, camera battery so make sure you get one of those ready so I think you need that for the uh, remote control the other point is that this mechanical chair has a few delicate parts so please make sure that you read the instructions and don't be too brutal when adjusting the chair or handling it especially the wires at the back I think you can see the wires at the back are quite thin and at the bottom here so please be careful with those parts. A friend of mine has actually already damaged part of it already and has to get it replaced. So uh, please be fragile with these guys. Anyway, time to queue up and pick up this figure. So thanks for watching. And big shout out to you collectors that have ordered this. Chris, I hope you get your figure very soon and I think you'll be really happy. Hey with guys, it. thanks for watching. Figures are picked up, ready to ship out tomorrow. They're gonna to be packaged up today. So just two things, um, I spoke to the staff over at Hot Toys, really helpful. Um, we spoke for about 10 15 minutes. They told me two things that I think you should, guys should be aware of. Number one, um, the battery you need to buy that fits inside Robocop is called an E90 or 910A RL, sorry, LR1 battery. These are the smaller batteries that fit in the um, old style cameras that you may be used to. Now, they said that there's two reasons why they chose that particular battery. Number one, they couldn't use um, the, triple, the, the three smaller circular watch batteries um, that are used with Ironman figures. Um, those are ones that are used in the repulsor hands um, that light up that go in the arm or in the eyes or in the arc reactor. They said that there was enough juice, not enough power to go through that. And they didn't want to use triple A or double A batteries because um, they're a bit longer. It would hinder the articulation because the compartment that fits into the body would be too large. So it looks like they've given this a little bit of thought. So I actually then asked them, why couldn't you include it separately? They said that these batteries, if over time, such as a year or so or six months, they could leak. Um, and they didn't want that leaking in their in their uh, figure boxes, so that's apparently the reason why they didn't include them with the uh, with the pack. So that's something for you to be aware of. You need to buy those batteries um, for the body. The second point is that the figure comes with two guns. The plastic gun is the one that goes into the thigh holster. 
Um, they're slightly different shape, so whatever you do, don't try and jam the other gun into the leg holster and it doesn't fit and it's going to damage either the compartment or the gun itself. So please make sure you read instructions so you know which gun to use for that holster. Okay guys? So anyway, today is Sunday, the game packaged up tonight, sent out first thing in the morning before I go to work. So you collectors who are expecting them, Aaron, I know you're dying for this, so hopefully if Customs doesn't have a problem, Parcel Force, your mate Woody at Parcel Force um, can help you out. Hopefully you get it on Wednesday or the latest Thursday. So you other guys who are picking them up, have fun, enjoy it, and um, thanks for watching.